In all of our history, only one Supreme Court justice has ever been impeached. But now, talk of it happening a second time. A lot of Democrats that I talked to, aides to members of Congress, suggested, like, could this be something where Clarence Thomas be impeached? And they aren't alone. Check out some of these tweets calling for Justice Clarence Thomas to resign. Here's why. The Washington Post published some of the texts Thomas's wife, Ginny, sent to the former White House Chief of Staff, Mark Meadows, urging him to overturn the 2020 election results. The 29 texts include, the majority knows Biden and the left is attempting the greatest heist of our history. And also, in response to a text from Meadows, this plus a conversation with my best friend just now, I will try to keep holding on. Ginny Thomas has previously publicly referred to her husband as my best friend. And here's what raised eyebrows when it comes to Justice Thomas and the bench. In January, Thomas was the only justice to try to block the National Archives from releasing White House documents requested by the January 6th Select Committee. His wife's text to Meadows were among those requested. This feels like a deeply unethical decision by Justice Thomas not to recuse himself from having anything to do with making decisions about the insurrection. We'll have to wait and see what happens next. Justice Thomas has been in the hospital with an infection and he's expected to make a full recovery, but there is some speculation he might retire, citing his health as a reason. Straight from DC, I'm Annie Anderson.